Welcome to another video of my tech YouTube channel. So today we're here to talk about how to upgrade your Elasticsearch cluster from one version to another. So uh, before we go ahead, we need to first check the compatibility of your Elasticsearch nodes, your Kibana and the Logstash nodes. All right. So uh, if the Elasticsearch node is running on, say, for example, 7.x and you want to, uh, sorry, 7.0 three or 7.4 and you want to upgrade your Kibana version from 7.4 to 7.15 or 1.6 it would actually work it would be compatible however if you're going to upgrade it from uh, 7.x to 8.x you would have to upgrade it to the latest version of that parent version say for example if you're running your Elasticsearch from uh, uh, 7.4 you have to upgrade it to the latest stable version of that parent version which is 7.17 and only then you can upgrade it to 8.0 all right so make sure that you you check the compatibility of uh, compatibility matrix of your Elasticsearch cluster nodes before you go ahead and upgrade it because while upgrading you might uh, have to face many errors if you don't check the compatibility all right and uh, once you check the compatibility and you know for a sure you know for a fact that it can be upgraded go ahead and stop all the shards allocation all right so uh, this is the link where you have all the apis in order to safeguard your uh, data before you go ahead and upgrade your elastic search however if you're in a staging or lower environment i would recommend you to just stop all the elastic search nodes and your kibana and your log stash nodes before you go ahead and upgrade it that is much simpler because there's there's no uh, shards allocation going to happen or anything going to happen when you stop your Elasticsearch and uh, Logstash and Kibana nodes, all right? Okay, so as you can see here, uh, the second step would be downloading the Debian package or the RPM package. I have already done it. And uh, just to show you, I have uh, I have these nodes running on 7.15. One of my nodes is 7.15 and the other node as well is 7.15. Now let's go ahead and stop the uh, Elasticsearch service, service Elasticsearch stop you have to also stop your kibana service okay so one of the node is done now let's go ahead and stop the other node as well okay so uh, now before we go ahead and upgrade it to 8.0 as i told you i have to upgrade it to 7.17 okay so for that dpkg iphone iphone install Elasticsearch 7.17 okay so let's go ahead and upgrade it it'll ask you whether you want to replace the uh, yaml files the configuration files with the latest one or you want to keep the existing version okay i'm going to just leave it to default which is no i want to keep it to the current version enter enter and here we go so it has installed 7.17 now on the left side let's do the same thing dpkg iphone iphone install Elastic search 1.7 and here we go. So it's going to install it. Okay. So on the right side, let's go ahead and quickly start the Elastic Search node and let's see if it's working. All right. So the left side as well, it has been upgraded. Now let me quickly check the configuration file if there are any changes or not. okay so it's the same configuration file it hasn't changed the configuration file instead your new uh, upgraded versions uh, yaml files will be saved with the format as dot rpm as you can see here or oh, not this one etc elastic search as you can see here it has stored under the uh, name as elasticsearch.yaml.dpkg iphone dist that is the latest versions yaml file okay so uh, let's go ahead and start this uh, node as well start okay so the right side it has been started let's see elastic search status here we go it's up and running ssi for net grep 9200 here we go the port is open as well okay here we go so both the nodes have been started now if i refresh here we go. We have it as 7.1, 7.1, which is the latest version of 7.x. Okay. Now let's go ahead and straight away upgrade the Elasticsearch node to 8.0. Okay. 
So for that, let me quickly stop the Elasticsearch node. Yes, so it's going to upgrade it to the latest version. Before that here as well, we have to stop it. Stop and then dpkg iPhone iPhone install Elastic Search iPhone 8. Yes. So uh, let's go ahead and select no. We don't want to upgrade anything. We just want to upgrade the version of Elastic Search. Yes. So the version has been upgraded. Now let's go ahead and quickly start the Elastic Search node on the left side. No. Okay. This is done as well. Start. Okay. Before we start the second node, let's wait for a few seconds for the uh, you know for the first node to start up. All right, the Elasticsearch node has started. Let's go ahead and check the status. Here we go. Let's go ahead and start the second node. And before we go ahead and uh, check the version on the UI, let's go ahead and quickly check the Kibana. I mean, let's go ahead and quickly upgrade the Kibana version as well. So dpkg, dpkg, iPhone, iPhone install, Kibana. So we are going to upgrade it straight away to uh, seven point uh, sorry eight point zero because we have already upgraded to Elasticsearch eight point zero. All right. So uh, yes, on the left side, the Elasticsearch Elasticsearch node has started. Let's check the status. Yes. Now we can straight away go to the browser and check the version now. All right. As you can see here, it is eight point zero point one of one node and the second node is the same okay so let's just wait for kibana to be upgraded from 8.0.01 okay uh here we go that has started service kibana status it's up and running all right so uh the main thing the the, the steps that follows after upgrading is you have to reload the daemon okay make sure to reload the daemon and then restart the service one more time because sometimes you might face an issue that okay the services or the uh, the the plugins and stuff like that are not mapped properly for the latest version so it's always better to reload the uh, daemon once and restart the services all right the second node has started as well let's go ahead and quickly check the status of kibana okay as you can see here kibana has failed but let's go ahead and restart kibana Okay, so uh, there's a problem. As I told you, once we upgrade, there might be some errors or issues coming up with the with the services. Okay, so it says Kibana has restarted very frequently, right? However, there is a long bunch of uh, errors. Config validation of logging definition for this key is missing. Okay. All right, the problem seems to be over here, uh, wherein you have to check the system uh, file that is the service file okay so let's go ahead and quickly edit kibana.service okay and uh here we go so it is searching for this okay so let's go ahead and quickly remove that part login destination is to be removed okay I have removed that part. Let me quickly restart Kibana and let's check the status. Okay, so it seems to be working fine. Let's go ahead and quickly check the port number 5601. It's not up yet. However, it should be okay. So uh, another issue. Okay, so it says Kibana failed, fatal, config validation, elasticsearch.username. So it wants us to use another, uh, you know, name just for safety purposes. Okay. So let's go ahead and give that uh, credentials for this to start up. Okay. So over here, I have all my credentials saved. So let me quickly change it to Kibana system, Kibana underscore system. Okay. And this is going to be my password. It's a long password.
Okay, so Kibana seems to be up and running now. Let's check if the port is, yes, even the port is up and running. So the issue was with the credentials. Okay, now let's go ahead and quickly check if it is working fine with 192.5601. okay so it has been upgraded and it just took a few seconds to get the license information and stuff like that let's go ahead and quickly check uh, if it is working fine now and here we go it's trying to log in and we need to be working with 8.0.1 all right so explore on my own that's it with the video guys in case you like the video give us a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos on elk and devops and isari kind of video take care and bye bye